Hi, in this video you will learn how to assemble the truss tracking area correctly. For the assembly, we need Horizontal grid environment in anti-latency service. You can use the examples we provide via the link in the description to make the environment yourself by choosing the truss preset. Trusses the truss tracking area is compatible with trusses such as Global Truss, F33250, F34250, or their analogs with a main pipe diameter of 50 mm, a pipe center to center distance of 240 mm, and a length of 2.5 m. Power supply unit with an output voltage of 18 volts. You can order a specialized power supply with truss mounts and the necessary connectors on our website. A standard 220 volt connection cable. Truss Kit Set, which includes four truss reference bars, connection wires, and two templates. Before moving on to building the truss tracking area, remember that the horizontal grid environment shows the view of the area from above, that is, we will see the mirror image of the truss when standing under it. It is necessary to determine one of the four options for bar placement, considering the mirror image on the picture before installing. The two templates included in the set are used for the exact placement of the bars according to the picture. They are installed on the side where the distance from the bar to the edge of the truss segment is less than on the other side. Then we hang the bars on the trusses, align them according to the templates, and fix them with fasteners. This way, the bars are placed according to the picture given in the horizontal grid. After that, you have to place the power supply unit and connect the bars. Each bar has two GX16 connectors on each side, which allows the bars to be daisy-chained without the use of splitters. Each one of them can work both as an input and an output. The power supply set also includes a cable with a GX16 output. If everything is assembled correctly, all marker indicators will turn green when you switch them on. 